The problem with the Subaru XV car is that when the car's engine is running, the check engine light comes on in the dashboard. The engine RPM goes up and down, engine idle problem. When driving, the engine suddenly shuts off engine power is very low. Now I start the car engine see check engine light on dashboard. Let me show you how this car engine RPM drop down and up on dashboard, car engine idle problem, how to check and how to solve engine idle problem, so watch the full video. Best wishes and congratulations from this channel. First, I will check with the scan computer to find out why the check engine light came on. Engine code P0171 system 2 lean bank 1. The P0171 code can mean that the oxygen sensor detects too much oxygen or too little fuel in the air to fuel ratio. Some possible causes of imbalance include vacuum leaks, malfunctioning mass airflow sensors, and a clogged fuel filter. Actually the fuel trim system is too lean for an oxygen sensor problem. Bank 1 Subaru XV How to Identify and Replace Oxygen Sensor Bank 1 Subaru XV Oxygen Sensors are located side by side Bank 1 Sensor 1 is the gray color war socket near the front of the engine and the black color war socket is Bank 1 Sensor 2. To change the upstream air fuel ratio sensor, first open the wire socket of the sensor. Use these special tools 22 mm size socket spanner to open the air fuel ratio sensor sensor Subaru XV. Now I will remove the upstream air fuel ratio sensor. Symptoms of a faulty oxygen slash air fuel ratio sensor. Common indications of a bad oxygen slash air fuel ratio sensor include rough idling, engine ping, poor gas mileage and increased exhaust emissions. One of the first signs of a faulty sensor is the illumination of the check engine light. Removed the old upstream air fuel ratio sensor, now I will install this new air fuel ratio sensor. Once the upstream air fuel ratio sensor is installed, then tighten it using spanner. The upstream air fuel ratio sensor is installed now plug its socket. Now I get inside the car to clear the engine code with the scan computer. First place the ignition key in the on position to clear the engine code. Now I will clear the engine fault code use for scan computer auto line scan 3. Engine code clear no fault code now I will start the car engine. After clearing the engine code, now start the car engine and see if the check engine light is off or not, if there is an engine idling problem or not. Ok now I on car air condition check for engine idling no problems. Now I will put the gear in the shift R position and see if the engine idling is causing the problem inshallah no problem now, inshallah, now there is no problem with engine idling while driving, there is no problem with engine power, if there is any problem in understanding anything in the video, please comment.